up, guys, and welcome back. I'm Van, and we are all the LFR family. And if you're not already with the LFR family, I'm going to need for you to hit that subscribe button right there, Jack. Go on, hit that thing. Hit that thing. All right, guys, it's Tom McDonald week. Y'all already know what it is, man. Shout out to Jordan McBee from ATL for putting together my list of Tom McDonald joints to check out because I wouldn't be able to do it without my Patreon members and my subscribers, man. Y'all are dope. Thank you for everything. Um, so we about to do some Mac Lethal Sucks. I just now checked out Lethal Injection. That joint was all right. It was all right. But I did see the, um, see the hypocrisy and, um, and what Mac Lethal wrote on them tweets and how, um, and, and, and how he came back after they called his ass out after the hangover game it was like, bro, that's a cop out. Stop faking. You know that, you know, you was talking to um, Tom McDonald. Stop faking. If that's what you do, if that's what you're saying, stand behind yours. Let's go. And you know, Tom McDonald jumped all over. So he did y'all like give him the business and lethal injection. I mean, I'm not too hype about it, but that drink was all right. So let's check out this Mac Lethal Sucks. Apparently this drink go hand in hand with it because uh, he just constantly going at him. Yeah, I thought that drink came out in June of 2019 too. Hmm. Did I check out? Hold on. Did, did the other one come out in June of 2019 or did it come out in July of 2019? Did I check out the wrong one first? No, this is this part two. Okay. All right, let's do it, guys. No more talking. Let's run it. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments below. <laughs> oh, my God. Tower beats on the track. Listen, I think I can hear it. McLeathal is hyping himself in the mirror. His wife tries to tell him that she's getting curious. He just yells, Shut the fuck up, it's this tongue guy's serious. I hoped you would kill it. I'm always out. Hold on. I like, I like how this joint is starting out. I like how this joint is starting out. A lot more energy in this joint right here. A lot more energy in this joint. And, and it's, it, it sounds like it's preparing me for a beat to drop. So now I'm just saying, no, I'm sitting on a dag on edge of the seat waiting for the beat to drop. All right, go. His wife tries to tell him that she's getting curious. He just yells, Shut the fuck up, it's this tongue guy's serious. I hoped you would kill it. I'm always an optimist. Thought your response would be flawless and awesome. It's got to be hard finding time to perfect all your rhymes every night at Narcotics Anonymous. Hi, wow. Dave. Hi. Wow. God damn. Is he really on that sugar honey iced tea? Is he? If he is, man, that's a sickness. You don't mess with nobody about this sickness. He had daggone AA meetings writing rhymes. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing at this because people are actually going through some real stuff that they got to go to AA meetings for, man. So the fact that I'm laughing at this is bullshit. <laughs> there you go. It's an awesome. It's got to be hard finding time to perfect all your rhymes every night at Narcotics Anonymous. Hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. I'm not even trying. You don't scare me at all. If you did a drive-by, I'd wave. It's so cute when you... Hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. <laughs> you don't scare me at all. If you did a drive-by, I'll wave. <laughs> he, he drive by like, break yourself, fool. Are you not scared? Go, nigga, go. Drive, nigga, drive. He's scared to even pull the trigger now, bruh. Because he all waving at him like, <laughs> was that for me? <laughs> that was a clever line. I like that. That was a clever line. Dying, you don't scare me at all. If you did a drive-by, I'd wave. It's so cute when you rap. It's like I'm watching my dad. Trying to use an iPad. You should just give it back. You've been sober like eight years. You're the type of guy who can't have a beer. Have a single drink and need to get some coke and probably suck a dick for a painkiller. You party Ooh. Gracious. Wow. I can't have a beer, have a single drink and need to get some coke and probably suck a dick for a painkiller, you party animal, you bad boy, you're a crazy son of a gun. All that karate and still you're a pussy, you tap on my shoulder and run? Where are you going? I'm over here in a house that you can't afford with your career. Got your own pool, kids in private school, you the fucking mother of the year. You keep talking millions like you- <laughs> Okay. This drain is better than lethal injection already, man. Already, because I like the energy better. I like the flow better. The humor is better already, man. Already. 
I know y'all probably don't think so, but whatever, man. It's my opinion. I think this dream is better. With your wealth. You are worth two, Dave. I am worth 12. You're tweeting at YouTube. Somebody help with my monetized videos. Dave, that's a tell. Broken, ugly, short and stubby, 40 something with a face that was born for punch and act tough. But I know at your court's muffins, the type to wife up the first horror fuck them. Woo! Big bad Dave got the Ellen Co sign. Cool. Try to ride that wave to the Hollywood sign. Fool. You His rhyme scheme is way better than Lethal Injection, man. I'm glad he made this one to follow after that one. He probably listened to Lethal Injection was like, meh. Because mm. that's what I, when I heard it, I was like, okay, he said some slick stuff. He said some slick stuff. Of course, I'm bobbing my head because I like drums. When the drums kick, I'm, I can be listening to freaking, uh, uh, what's his name? What's that Bama name that be singing? Got the big gap in his teeth. Can't think of his name right now. Ice oh, sign. Cool. Try to ride that wave to the Hollywood sign. Fool. You were so excited just to get invited. Keep were freshly white and couldn't cheese enough. You said, I love rap because it's counterculture. Dave, counterculture is who beats you up. My future has Grammys. Your future is handies from Tammy imagining baddies and nasty pajamas and transplanting hair to your head from your fanny. That was a nice run on words right there i i mean I, I just like the delivery and the cadence in that that was really nice bro that was nice and he's switching it he's switching it up a lot in this joint right here i like that too I love rap because it's counterculture dave counterculture is who beats you up my future has grammys your future is handies from tammy imagining baddies and nasty pajamas and transplanting hair to your head from your fanny Woo! i saw you doing teeth commercials you an actor dave i don't need rehearsals i'll piss in your mouth till you wheeze and gurgle and stomp on your head till your cheeks are purple i was a wrestler Whoa. i wore spandex you were a customer you did xanax i'll take you and your bitch by the ear and then smash you together like stone cold's beer being a fucking loser hold up he was a wrestler before was he a wrestler for real wow didn't know that. You did Xanax. I'll take you and your bitch by the ear and then smash you together like Stone Cold's beer. Being a fucking loser's in your DNA. If this ain't a punchline, it's a PSA. The chromosomes from your mom pod create retards and they name him Dave. No, but wow. He is going hard on this dude. I mean, although he called him a retard in the first one. But the way he said it in this one, the chromosomes between your mom and pops, they create retards and they call him Dave. So, wow. Damn, Dave. I need to hear Dave's response, man. Now I got to call him Dave. <laughs> safe to wipe you to chain up her legs, remove all her eggs, put them in bags and then lock them away in the safe and send it away on a plane. I'm lucky that I know CPR. My girl heard you this and she died laughing. She was bummed we waited like a week and then she went right back into Minecrafting. My Ooh. girl was on Death Jam. Your girl looked like death, fam. She the Grim Reaper, knew I'd spit ether. She collecting the soul of a dead dad. There God damn, bruh. He is murdering him on this joint. This joint should have been called Lethal Eje Injection. Because this is the... This is the kill shot. Shh. This joint. Your girl look like death fam. She the grim reaper. Knew I'd spit ether. She collecting the soul of a dead dad. They're gonna need a whole family of coffins when you Chris Benoit to solve all your problems. The shame and embarrassment. All of the comments from fans you had. I saw it. You lost them. Ain't dropped an album in four years. Dog, rapping is your hobby. My career less than a year. 20,000 physical copies. Woo! I have millions of streams. I'm living your dream. You're a glorified YouTuber. Look like a meme. Go to stupid extremes. Definition to try hard. Watch me rap after eating a Tide Pod. Dying for attention. That's why you started this little beef. You're so desperate. Expect that right after this ends your sex day probably league <laughs> was he just making fun of him like okay this is this is the type of dumb stuff that people do like watch me rap after i eat this tide pot and is he this desperate to be seen and heard like is he this much of a failure with his rap career again i don't know who the hell mac lethal or dave is I gotta look, I gotta look this guy up now. You started this little beef. You're so desperate to expect that right after this ends, your sex day probably leak. You've been on Ellen and Rogan, why aren't you a star? Here, let me tell you, it is in the bars. It's the way that you look, it's the way that you are. Nobody cares about your music no more. Dog, you do impressions. You rapping 20 styles and you think it's flexing. I got a question, why you gotta pretend to be everyone else to resemble impressive? I killed you already, this don't need a sequel. I'm honestly bored with this shit. Feels like I'm kicking the corpse's shoes. You can't afford to feel horrible doing you like this. 
How many rappers wrote your response? Come on, Dave, give him credit. I know you sent texts, I saw with my eyes, I know what you said, Dave, I read it. You a real piece of Wow, man, he is going so hard on this dude, man. I think he want to fight him. And if I was dag on Mac Lethal, well, he do karate, so he'll probably whoop. He'll probably whoop Tom ass. If he did karate, a person that do karate can whoop a wrestler's ass. If I knew karate, I'd fight a wrestler. I would. I would. I would karate size your ass. Right now, I don't know karate, but I know crazy. <laughs> I chop your ass in the neck like 10, 15 times. If you still breathing, I, I'm, I'm still fast. I still, I run. I ain't no fight. I'm a level. Shoes, you can't afford to feel horrible doing you like this. How many rappers wrote your response? Come on, Dave, give him credit. I know you sent texts, I saw it with my eyes, I know what you said, Dave, I read it. You a real piece of shit. Now I'm like a real piece of shit. Like if a piece of shit ate a piece of shit and took a pee and shit, you're that piece of shit. I'm on like, wow! Like, you're a real piece of shit. I mean, like a real piece of shit. Like if a piece of shit ate a piece of shit and took a, and took a piss, then the shit, You'll be that piece of shit. I don't even know what the hell he said, but he, he, he I'm believing right now. I'm a believer. It's like when somebody go to church and they, who, they, they, oh Lord, <laughs> hallelujah. They get that spirit. They, that they know the Lord is there. <laughs> Woo. Oh, oh, I'm a believer now that Dave is probably a piece of shit only because of this rhyme scheme right here i gotta hear this right now i gotta hear this again this is my favorite part of the joint right here like you're a real piece of shit no i mean a real piece of shit <laughs> like if a piece of shit ate a piece of okay i know you sent text i saw with my eyes i know what you said they've read it you're a real piece of shit now i'm like a real piece of shit like if a piece of shit ate a piece of shit and took a pee and shit, you're that piece of shit. I'm on like five what? minutes, shit, let me see. You were canceled on fire from MTV. The network wanted something fresh and clean. I bet any day they'll be calling me. You left rhyme stairs cause you had to. You didn't walk away, wasn't something you planned, dude. Got lost in the drugs in the whirlwind. Caught pants down with another man's girlfriend. Piece Woo. of shit. Nah, like a real piece of shit. Like if a piece of shit fucked a piece of shit and got an STD, you're that piece of shit. You got- Wow. Now if a piece of shit ate a piece of shit, then took a pee and shit. You're that piece of shit. Or a piece of shit. Fuck the piece of shit. They got an STD. You're that piece of I'm Dave really is a piece of shit. I don't even know the guy, but I think he's a piece of shit. I think I said shit way too many times in this video to be monetized. Sorry. But it's his fault, man. God damn it. Like a real piece of shit. Like if a piece of shit fucked a piece of shit and got an STD, you're that piece of shit. You got a pet bird, bet you never thought you'd be dead first. I'ma put you both in the oven when you get burned. I'ma put you both in a pet urn. Piss into the bottle, mix it up and turn the ash into plaster. Give Woo! it to your bitch. Tell her mix. He gon' he said he gonna kill him and his bird. Then piss inside of the urn. Mix it up and make some plaster. Sheesh. I'ma put you both in a pet urn, piss into the bottle, mix it up and turn the ash into plaster. Give it to your bitch, tell her to make statues of me just to capture my win. My girl will just spit in her face and we'll dip, get a hammer and come back and smash it to bits. Put a plaque Woo! in his place so that no one forgets that your biggest mistake was as good as it gets for a guy whose career doesn't even exist at the peak of the mountain for you. This is it, your aesthetic is pathetic, you don't get it, I'm prophetic. Your rapathetics are born, fucking get his world record. Be careful where you were headed, I'm cemented as a legend. David Sheldon severed out his destiny to be the evidence. Every roommate. This is a diss, bruh. Just in case someone wants to know how to write a diss, Mac Lethal Sucks is Exhibit A. God damn, he is going in. I right, go. His career doesn't even exist at the peak of the mountain for you. This is it. Your aesthetic is pathetic. You don't get it. I'm prophetic. Your rapathetics are born. Fuck a Guinness world record. Be careful where you are headed. I'm cemented as a legend. David Sheldon severed out his destiny to be the evidence. Every room you ever enter, I will always be the elephant. While you try to fit this capital L into development, you dead little Lennon. I send a letter to heaven that explodes when it opens. I hope it gets your attention. I can smell it. This dude said, I will always be the elephant in the room. <laughs> And what do you say when you take this capital L and do what with it? You were headed, I'm cemented as a legend. David Sheldon severed out his destiny to be the evidence. Every room you ever enter, I will always be the elephant. While you try to fit this capital L into development, you dead little Lennon, I send a letter to heaven that explodes when it opens. I hope it gets your attention. I can smell it, you sweating, and it's 11 11. I make a wish that when you die, you come back resurrected so I can kill you again and again and again for the record. If you're feeling kind of froggy and you jump, you get dissected. Oh dear, I can't believe I had to say. Wow, he said if you're feeling froggy, then jump. 
and get dissected. That's Again and again and again for the record If you're feeling kind of froggy and you jump you get dissected Oh dear, I can't believe I had to set this shit straight Man, old ears, I hope you hear exactly what I say Man, I'm here, you said you didn't even know my name Dog, so here, I'll say it so you don't forget it, gang It's Tom McDonald, bitch That's just how he ended the last one He said, I'm gonna say my name again so you won't forget it It's Tom McDonald, bitch I wonder if he got that from the Chappelle show. But I'm Rick James, bitch! I, this joint was way better than Lethal Injection. If I had to compare the two, I would say Lethal Injection was whack as fuck. I would like to compare this to, um, to Dave's disc, back to Tom McDonald. But I don't have that, so... Per usual, guys, I want to hear what y'all got to say about this in the com in the comments below. And if you have yet to hit that subscribe button, please make sure you do so on your way out the door. Once again, guys, I'm Van. We are all the LFR family. I look forward to seeing y'all on the next video. Peace.